I don't know if you're aware, Bruce Feldman let this out on the Move the Sticks podcast. Talking to Daniel Jeremiah and Bucky Brooks. You know, Michigan has, as well you might, a, a beat Ohio drill in practice. Okay. A period. It's a period called beat Ohio, which we love using the word Ohio. It offends Buckeye fans because they're not only Ohio State, they're the Ohio State. There's an Ohio University that is famous for Peter King graduating from it. Well, they cross out the M's. It's really weird. Uh, but Right. There's a beat Ohio. Right. They get very upset. There's a beat Ohio period. It focuses the guys on, on the very important week. Apparently, Jim Harbaugh has now added a beat Georgia period during practice. Oh, have they ever played? They have, as you remember, uh, famously on a New Year's Eve a couple of years All ago. Right. What happened? Didn't that? go very well. Yeah. But I kind of dig it. I dig it. Because I'll tell you what, I, I'll be very honest with you. When I first arrived at Michigan in 1986, I kept thinking to myself, why do they view the Rose Bowl as the ultimate? Why are they talking about right. winning the Big Ten and the Rose Bowl being the ultimate? That's always was the focus. Let's make the Rose Bowl. Let's win the Rose Bowl. That's the year. Mm. And I'm like, why aren't we talking national championships around here? And then we started to get number one and win if a Rose Bowl. If you win the Bowl, Rose Bowl, usually you're going to be That was the, the idea, yeah. right? It was a different era, but I was it, it was kind right. of just off-putting to me, you know. As a Yankee fan, used to winning World Series in my youth. Yeah. Oh, so many. Again, if you remember, it's 1986. 1986. Glory days. So I was beginning to wonder that. And I kind of dig that Jim's like, okay, okay. I'm sure it's a bigger Alabama's prize here. Probably offended Maybe. by that. I don't know, right? but Georgia's the back-to-back champions one year, curb stomping Michigan on the way to their first of the two titles yeah. in a row. You got to respect that at least, right, Chris? Well, I'm, where, I mean, where he's having a am I the Georgia mouthpiece now? No, yeah, yeah, sure, go ahead. Yes, you are. You are. I don't think. It's like the Don Draper gif. I don't think Georgia I, spends one second thinking about Michigan. I agree. I am, I'm with you on that. I don't I'm think. With all due respect. I, I don't think it's yeah. disrespectful at all. I don't think it's disrespectful at all. Think, They're not think, sitting there in the heart of SEC country thinking about Michigan no, or, or Ohio State. Nope. I think it's beat Alabama and we win the national championship. Right. I think so. And when you say beat Alabama, when do they play them? Well, in the game that matters. Uh huh. Yeah. If yeah. if they meet in the SEC championship it just, it's not, game, at least Michigan knows they're playing Ohio State really at least once. Well, they're in the so. same division. I, I, again, we have to just keep going over this. <laughs> but I do dig that. I heard that beat Georgia. I'm like, what all is right. The drill is it? Or is I have it just no idea. The... It's not a drill. It's a period. Oh, like, okay. hey, it's the beat Georgia period. So I let's see. focus in. This is going to be a task that we're going to try and uh, mount. Interesting. Should we have to mount it? <laughs> you know, this is an achievement. We're going to have to beat. This is the period in which we beat the national champions. What about I the, dig it. What about the beat TCU uh, period? Uh-huh. <laughs> When's that? Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, we're not scheduled to play them. Oh. Mm-hmm. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern, for free. 